It's time for person, place, or thing. Our first player is Pete, and his favorite person is Melissa Peterman. Our second player is Melanie, and her favorite place is Antarctica. And our third player is Charles, and his favorite thing is his Xbox. And now, because she likes when you look at her, it's Melissa Peterman. Look at me! Welcome to Person, Place, or Thing. They ask the questions, I give the clues, and whoever gets the most right can win lots of cash and prizes. And joining me today, I have a bunch of smart competitors who are here to battle it out for their chance to play for $5,000, our grand prize. Nice, huh? And back with us for his 10th consecutive day is our returning champion, Pete who has now won $10,000 in cash, as well as four vacations and other prizes, bringing his winning totals to over $12,000. Yeah, you gotta give it up. 10 times, Pete. Uh, let's see if Charles and Melanie can start a winning streak of their own. You guys ready to get started? Let's yes. go. All right, we're gonna start with round one. We're gonna play each category, a person, a place, and a thing. You will be asking me yes or no questions, and I will be giving you clues. All right, let's do this. Hey, Pete. Hey, Melissa. That was awfully nice of you to say that your favorite person was Melissa Peterman. Well, we're basically family at this point. We really uh, are, yeah. yeah, yeah. There's a birthday today, so come to the break room for cake, okay? okay perfect, All right, perfect. good. All right, let's get started. We're gonna start with our person category. And Pete, I can tell you that this person is an entertainer. An entertainer? Mm hmm an entertainer. Okay, is this entertainer female? No. Mm -mm. Hello there, Melanie. Hello. How are you? I'm doing great today. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. Got a question for me? All right. So, has this person ever been on the cast of SNL? No. Okay. Good question. Okay. Okay. Very good yeah. question. Hi, Charles. Hi. How are you? Good. How are you doing? I'm doing real good. I'm doing real good. Is this entertainer still performing today? Yes. Still performing, okay? All right, get your buzzers out. It is time for your clue. Remember, if you buzz in and get it right, you got 100 points, but if you're wrong, you are out until the next clue. Here we go. This person is popularly known for his improvisation skills. Okay, that did not help anybody. All right, but just put it in your mind bank. It's gonna come back and help you out. Pete, what do you think? Uh, is this Wayne Brady? Boom! Out of the gate, 100 points. It is Wayne Brady, and uh, well done, 100 points. Thank you. All right, okay. Melanie, yeah. it is your turn. Wait, did you know that? Yeah. Did it come I, to you right after? I love Wayne Brady. I know. Ugh. I even thought him too. If I didn't like him so much, I'd hate him because he's so good at everything. Uh, all right, so we're gonna start off our place category. Okay. Okay, it is still Anyone's game. Here we go. This place is a landmark, Melanie. Landmark, okay? All right. Uh, is this landmark in Europe? No. Mm -mm. Charles. Landmark, not in Europe. Is this landmark in the United States? Yes, it is. Pete. All right. Is this landmark man-made? Yes. It is. Get your buzzers out. Here we go. Time for a clue. All right. This place is located on 42nd Street in New York City. Pete? Grand Central Station? It is Grand Central Station. All right. That means another 100 points to you. Well done. Don't worry. It's still anyone's game. <laughs> Charles, you are going to start this category. It's our thing category, Charles. And I can tell you that this thing is a body part. Is this thing on the upper part of your body? Yes. I would say it's on the upper part of the body. Okay? Pete. All right. Is this body part on your head? No. Okay. Mm -mm. Melanie. Is this body part used to hold things? No. Mm -mm. All right. Mm -hmm. Clue time. Here we go. This body part is located below the neck. Melanie? Uh, the clavicle. <laughs> the clavicle. No, it is not. But that is a great <laughs> guess. Really great guess. But that means you are out until the next clue. Charles. 
below the neck, not the clavicle. Is this body part the heart? It yeah. is the heart. Well done, well done. We've got 100 points. Awesome. Great round, Thank everybody. You. Great start to the game. Don't go anywhere. We're going to be right back. Our champ, Pete, is in the lead with 200 points, but Charles is on the board with 100. Melanie is at zero, but that could change. Coming up next, we got more great questions, greater clues on person, place, or thing. Do you want to learn more about our show and meet today's super fan? Use your smartphone to scan the QR code in the corner of your screen, and you will not only meet today's super fan, Lay, but you will also get access to behind the scenes fun and bonus content. Welcome back to Person, Place, or Thing. Now, here's the woman whose heart's been described as medically large, Melissa Peterman. <laughs> oh, Jamie, I love you. Welcome back. we got a great game going on here. Pete is in the lead with 200 points, but Charles on the board with 100. Melanie, not quite yet, but that could all change because it is time for round two. Round two is the same as the first round, except... We will double the points, and you can pick which category we are going to be playing. Melanie, since you are trailing behind, you are going to start things off. So what category would you like to play, person, place, or thing? I would like a place, Melissa. You would like a place? Yes, well, I'm please. going to give you, and your favorite place was Antarctica, wasn't it? Yes. How yes. come? Uh, it's the last continent that I have to go to before I hit all seven, and uh, winning this five grand would be would be very helpful to put to it in that To get you bucket. to Antarctica. All right, well, let's try to see if we can get you there. Okay. okay what ca you said place, right? Okay. Yes. Your place is a U.S. state. Okay. Okay. Is this state located on the West Coast? No. Mm -mm. Charles. Mm. Is the state home of the potatoes? Ooh, good one. No, it is not home of the potatoes. I wish every state was home of the potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Pete. All right, uh, is this state one of the original 13? Like, I like that you just shortened it. Like, you know what, the 13 colors, you know, one of the original 13. <laughs> uh, no, not, not, uh-uh. All right, it's time for a clue. This place is the only state to have a non-rectangular state flag. Mm. That did oh. not help anybody. Melanie, non rectangular. Is this state near a body of water? Yes. Charles, non rectangular <laughs> state flag. Okay. Is this state occupied by more than? 13,000 people. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Pete. Is this state in the Midwest? Yes. Time for your second clue. Get your buzzers out. It is bordered by Lake Erie to the north and Kentucky to the south. Pete. Is it Ohio? Oh, to the north. Never mind. Oh, that's right. <laughs> about that answer. Yeah, do you want to redo that? Take two. <laughs> Say it again, Pete. Uh, Ohio. Yes, it is Ohio. Well done. 200 points to you. You are in the lead again. Okay, Charles, it is your turn to pick. What do you want to play? Person, place, or thing? Uh, I'll do person. Person. Okay. All right. Well, Charles, I can tell you that this person is a celebrity. Okay. 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 Is this person currently in any films released in the past three months? Uh, I love your question, Charles. You are very specific and I like it. Uh, but I will tell you the answer to that question is no. Okay. Pete. Uh, is this celebrity female? No. Okay. Melanie. All right, is this celebrity over the age of 40? Yes. Okay. Time for a clue. Everyone have their buzzer? Here we go. This person was from Australia. Uh, 
did not help anybody. Charles. Oh, is this person Iggy, Iggy Azalea? No, okay. not Iggy Azalea. Okay. Pete. I'll wait for you to get here. Oh, because uh, oh, yeah, I'm moving too slow, Pete? I'm, I'm walking backwards, people, that's and, hard. And expertly walking backwards. Thank you, thank yes. you. Uh, is it Steve Irwin? Yes, it is Steve Irwin. Oh my gosh. All right, well, uh, 200 more points. You have 600 points now. Well done. And last but not least, it's your turn to pick the category. What do you want to play? I'm going to do my normal. I know, person. person. He's going to play person, people. I know you. Okay, I can tell you, this person, people are banned. Banned, okay? Uh, is this a rock band? Yes. Okay. Melanie. Is this band still currently releasing albums? What do you mean by currently, like? In the last three years. In the last three years. No, they have not released an album in the last three years. Okay. Charles. Is this band comprised of five or less members? Yes. Yes, good question, Charles. <laughs> Time for a clue. Get your buzzers out. This band's logo features a pair of red lips and a protruding tongue. Charles. Is it Kiss? No. Oh. It is not Kiss. Pete? It's the Rolling Stones. It is the Rolling Stones. Well done, another 200 points, and you swept that round, Pete. You are in the lead with 800 points. Great round, everybody. Don't worry, guys, it is still anybody's game. Great job. Don't go anywhere. We have a great game. Our champ swept that round and is in the lead with 800 points. Charles is on the board with 100. Melanie is not on the board yet, but that could change because up next, it's the speed round, and that will determine who will walk away a winner on person, place, or thing. Welcome back to Person, Place, or Thing, home of the potatoes. You get a potato, and you get a potato, and you get a potato. We have an exciting game going on here. Pete is in the lead with 800 points. Charles has 100. Melanie, you're not on the board yet, but don't you worry, because this next round, it could change everything. It is time for our speed round, so get your buzzers ready. In this speed round, I'm gonna read you a series of clues about a person, a place, or a thing. If you think you know it, buzz in and you will get 500 points. But if you buzz in and you're wrong, you are out until that next category comes up, okay? You guys ready? Yeah. Yes. I said, are you guys ready? Yes. Yes, all right. Jamie, put 90 seconds on the clock. Ohio State flag is a triangular swallowtail. Oh, thank you, that's good to know. Good luck, players. Time starts now. According to Forbes, this thing is something 50% of Americans have at least two of. It, Melanie, is it a car? No, it is made of plastic, but metal ones are becoming more common. Pete. Straw. No, it is commonly found in a wallet. Charles. Is it a credit card? Yes, credit card. This planet does not have any moons or natural satellites of its own. It is the smallest planet in our solar system. Melanie. Is it Pluto? No, it is the closest planet to the sun. It has no rings. Pete. Venus. No. Charles. Is it Mercury? Yes. Uh, according to Forbes, he is one of the top five richest men in the world. This person's first venture, Trafodata, analyzed roadway traffic counters. He wrote his first computer program at 13. Charles. Is it Mark Zuckerberg? No, time. He co-founded Microsoft. Pete. Bill Gates? Yes. This thing is a creamy, sweet drink. It is often served at Christmas. You might spike. Pete. Eggnog. Yes. Uh, Plato first wrote about this place about 2,000 years ago. This place was a setting for a 2001 Disney animated movie. According to DC Comics, it is ruled by Aquaman. Pete. Atlantis. Yes. This fictional person first appeared on the big screen in 1977. He is a fraternal twin and Jedi Knight. Pete. Luke Skywalker. Yes. This thing is a wearable. Oh my gosh! Charles, I thought. 
thought you were gonna get them. I really did. You were in there. Great job, everybody. You did so great. But you know what, Charles? You did not get enough points to beat Pete, and that means, Pete, you are going on to play our final round again. Melody, oh my goodness. I wish you the best of luck. I hope you're going to get yourself to Antarctica. And Charles, you were, you almost had it. Yeah. Great job. Thank you. And we are not going to send you both home empty-handed. So, Jamie, <laughs> tell them what they've won. My grandmas of New England, the world's most critically acclaimed gourmet coffee cakes, including our original cinnamon walnut coffee cake, made from the finest and freshest ingredients. As mentioned by the New York Times, People Magazine, and Oprah. Get a cake delivered to your door by visiting my grandma. Yeah. You get a coffee cake and you get a coffee cake. We loved having you so much and congrats, Pete. You are moving on to play for $5,000 in our final round sponsored by Slotomania. Jamie, tell them about it. Promotional consideration provided by Slotomania, the number one free slots game. Download Slotomania now and get one million free coins. Stick around to see if people win $5,000. We will be right back after this. You get a potato and you get a potato and you get a potato. Now it's your turn to play. Scan that QR code to win this amazing prize. Good luck. A full regimen skincare set from Hanacure. Maximize your skin health with a minimal routine with Hanacure, with formulas that are clinically tested to produce results in three simple steps. Welcome back to the final round of Person, Place, or Thing. I am standing here with Pete, who is about to play for $5,000 from our friends at Slotomania. Jamie, tell them about it. Slotomania, the number one free-to-play slots game in the world, with millions of players and non-stop fun and excitement. Scan the QR code to download Slotomania now and find out what will today spin. Thank you, Jamie. Okay, you've been here. This is your 10th time in yes. this final round. You have tied for the most times here. And I believe at the 11th time, you've promised to get a tattoo of my face on your arm. Absolutely, yeah. How is that gonna go over with your fiance, Weatherly? She's a huge fan, she'll be all right with okay, it. Okay, wonderful. Then we, it's a win-win for all of us. There we go. All right, so here's what you gotta do, Pete. You've gotta correctly identify a person, a place, and a thing in 60 seconds. You can start with any category you want. You can ask as many yes or no questions as you need. Guess as many times as you have to. And as always, I have three clues for you to use. You correctly identify a person, place, or thing, and you're gonna add $5,000 to your already over $12,000 worth of cash and prizes. And you're gonna get Lay, our super fan, 500 bucks. You ready? Let's do it. Okay, well I can tell you that your person is an actor. Your place is a U.S. city, and your thing is found in nature. Where do you want to start? So let's start with person. Person, okay. All right, we're gonna start with your person category. Jamie, put 60 seconds on the clock. Pete, if you win this one, can I borrow $20? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Fair. Sure. Good luck, Pete. Time starts now. All right, clue. This actor won an Oscar for writing Get Out. Jordan Peele. Yes, U.S. City. Clue. This city is a location for one of the Real Housewives franchises. New York. No. Chicago. No. Atlanta. No. Um, Los Angeles. No. Uh, Detroit. No. Uh, next. Found in nature. Uh, clue. It goes through an egg, larva, pupa, and adult stage. Uh, butterfly? Yes. Okay, uh, Real Housewives of Chicago. No. Of uh, Orange County. No. Of, uh, is it on the West Coast? Yes. Uh, Seattle. No. Portland. No. Uh, San Francisco. No. Uh, is it uh, in the Los Angeles area? Yes. Uh, is it Beverly Hills? Yes, congratulations, Pete, it was Beverly Hills. You named almost every city. Well done. You just won yourself another $5,000, bringing your winnings in cash and prizes to over $17,000. And you get to come back once again as our returning champion for a chance to win another $5,000. And Lay, congratulations to you too, buddy. You just won 500 bucks. Okay, Pete, I can't wait to see the tattoo of my face on your arm. Goodbye, everybody. This person wants you to come back to this place and watch Pete do his thing. Do your Real Housewives goodbye. You're still watching?
Oh my God, thank you. Well, in that case, be sure to stay up to date with Person, Place, or Thing by smashing that subscribe button. There's full episodes, behind the scenes content, and even a few surprises, and they're just a click away. You can go now.